Hello Connor, it is day 38. As for today, I have no idea what I'm going to be talking about, so I will probably end up rambling with little to no transitions, so try to keep up. First of all, the walrus? Yeah. Well, I didn't expect you to find a walrus with a top hat and a monocle already on it. Hey, let's make some plush walruses with top hats and monocles. Those'll sell. They don't do that. So I expected you to find a stuffed walrus or something that looks like a walrus that you could make look like a walrus or something. Find a tiny top hat and monocle or make a tiny top hat and monocle or improvise or something. It is called creative problem solving. I, I still expect that that walrus. I want that walrus. Like, I want that walrus. This is not debatable. You will get me a walrus. Not gonna lie, I was very impressed with father. Like, I was so impressed, I don't exactly believe that was dad. I feel like you just got some some guy to dress up in a costume and say it was dad. But I, I will take your word for it. My hair is getting so long. Look at this. I'm so excited. I don't know if you know this, but I'm growing it out again and hopefully cutting it next December right after Christmas. I don't want to cut it as short as it was last time because it was really short. It was like here. I don't like it there. I don't want it any shorter than my shoulders. But yeah, I like my hair long. Oh yeah, back to your video. When you went to interview Mark, Ike, and Bread, I'm like, Connor, that's, that's cheating. Come on. But then they started talking. Yikes. You need some smarter friends or something. Yeah, that was, that was a pretty sad discussion. But now that the campaign is over, I'm going to discuss my opinions. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, I'm so done with that nonsense. I'm honestly really excited that after a year, more than a year, of political ads constantly on TV, that's over with. But then Dad went and pointed out that now we are going to be bombarded with Christmas commercials. Dad, why did you point that out? I mean, I love Christmas, but it's... It's so overwhelming, all the music and the decorations and the constant happiness. <laughs> it's kind of odd that they have Christmas music, but they don't have music for any other holidays. Thanksgiving music, songs about turkeys. They don't have Easter music either. Songs about bunnies who poop eggs. That'd be a little weird. I know how the zombie apocalypse is going to occur. Superstorm Sandy has flooded a very large portion of New York, as I'm sure you know, and We'll be bringing up millions of sewer rats. So these sewer rats are going to be running around all of New York and they're going to be carrying ridiculously disgusting diseases and it's going to spread like a plague and mutate and become a zombie disease and it is going to spread across the entirety of the United States and that's how the zombie apocalypse is going to start. And it's just in time for the end of the world. There's like approximately a month and a half for these rats to get people disease ridden and mutated. Those rats better get on that because I'm looking for a zombie apocalypse here. Also in an overtired rage, I found a picture of a monkey that I was convinced looked like an old man that turned into a monkey and it is from March of 1967. I just kind of took it because I was overtired and I was going insane. So obviously I'm running out of ideas so you should do me a favor since I did you a favor and compile at least a short list of challenges that I can do over the next few videos. I will see you tomorrow. Bye, Connor.